Hey, air sign. How are you? This is uh, your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus reading for November 15th. I know. How about that? Isn't that crazy? Right? Miss Delilah sitting right here. Can you see? There she is. Hi, Delilah. That's a cat who cured herself of diabetes. I don't know how that worked, but she did it. Kind of amazing. All right, guys, so let's see what's going on here for you. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus, air sign. Let's see what's happening. Uh, I got a couple of announcements. Okay, opening up private readings. We are doing that Thanksgiving weekend. Um, there's going to be half-hour readings, live readings, but also uh, recorded readings. So that's something that um, a fair amount of people outside of the U.S. have been asking for, so I'm going to open that up again. Um, also the, <laughs> the, uh, retreat is going to be happening December 5th in Atlanta. Love to have you. Um, woo. Okay. What's this sun? Yes. Sun card for you. Okay. And I'd uh, love to have you. If you, if you are so inclined, the link is below. There's a video on my channel about, uh, what's going on at the retreat. So if you want to see that, it's on the channel. Okay. Here we go. Air sign. Let's see what's happening for you. I know. Listen to her. Seven of Wands. Needing to stand up for yourself, are we? Needing to set your boundaries with somebody who loves you very much. Wow. 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 Holy cow. Oh my goodness. This is intense. This is uh, divine timing. Wow. Okay. So this is a new relationship. All right, this is a new relationship. Actually, the interesting part of this relationship is that it's probably a past life relationship. So even though it might be a new relationship to you, you've known each other lifetime after lifetime. Um, there's lots of feminine energy here, lots of love energy. Um, that sun is so beautiful. Leo, Aquar Leo um, Sagittarius, Aries. You guys are moving forward. All right. Yes. Judgment. Wow. Oh my gosh. Wait till I show you this reading. Okay. So, um, you, my darling, check this out. Empress, two of wands, queen of pentacles, super in love, super nurtured, feeling good. Somebody who loves themselves. All right. This is you who have done this work and you have done this work. You are, you are ready to love this person. Okay. Uh, this person coming into your into your life or has been in your life or is a past for some of you is a past life relationship okay you probably know who this person is and if you haven't met them yet you're gonna meet them very soon okay um, this is someone who has been in your life maybe for 10 years okay because there's a timing card here of 10 years 10 is pentacle 10 right 10 of Pentacles 10. Pentacles are years. Whenever I see that card, it tells me that this is somebody who feels like family to you, feels like coming home. Okay. You, the person you're connecting with here, queen of cups, 10 of pentacles, queen of wands. So not only are they super sexy to you, air sign, they are also loving. They are grounded. Okay. There's a lot of grounding here. This is destiny. Right. And you both are knowing it. You both are knowing it now. All right. You're both when you meet or as you, you might have resisted this person. If you've known them for a long time, you might have resisted them or they might have resisted you. Okay. And now you guys are like, this is my person. This is my person ready to move forward. Wheel energy, destiny energy, moving forward to victory. Ace of cups. Seriously. This is, um, this is destiny. Wow. Where's my deck? This is destiny. I want to know because the uh, Jupiter coming into Sag, there's Sag energy here. There's so many. Um, there's fire sign. There's Cancerian energy. Uh, hang on one second. Let's see. Okay. Chariot energy. Ten of Wands. Burdens were put down so that things could move forward. Somebody had to put down some burdens put down doing all the work, put down 
somebody had to put down old relationship patterns so you could be free to move forward. Okay? That's what needed to happen on both sides. Okay? That needed to go so that you could go free. And both of you know, right? There's a lot of freedom here in this relationship. This is going to be a nice, beautiful beginning here. Beautiful beginning. There's something so amazing about this. Incredible. I really love this. <laughs> Air sign. So there's three queens here, and then we have the empress, which is all the queens. So this person could have very balanced masculine energy, feminine energy. Hi, Ellie. Um, there, there does feel like there's some masculine here. This chariot energy feels very masculine, but it's connected to the moon, connected to Pisces. Please stop ruining my furniture. Thank you. Ellie. Um, so let's see. So the, the, the thing that needs to happen here is to stop resisting the awareness of this, this is your person. So you can move forward. Okay. This is destiny. Ta-da. All right, air sign. This is happening. This is happening. You've known this person for quite some time. There's love here on both sides. And now you get a new chance to start again. If it was past life, especially. Right. All right, guys, the link is below for the extended. I will see you on the other side.